Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Walkthrough Wednesday. Let me ditch this so I look less like a dork. We do wear these in here to keep everybody safe, our staff and including you guys. I am standing in front of the massive and the beautiful Montana High Country 373RD. Did I get that right, Chris? Yes. See, I didn't cheat, I didn't look yes. over there. Did you see that? This thing is awesome. I wanna show you a couple of things on the outside and then we'll go take a look at the inside. Come on, Chris. So first thing I wanna show you, uh, Sometimes with these campers, you either sacrifice outside storage or you sacrifice inside space. This one, you've got the best of both worlds. So as you see, we have this massive storage at the rear. This slides out. You could keep kayaks in here. You could keep family members in here. You name it, you can keep them in here. You do have access on both sides as well. So you can keep fishing poles, that type of thing. Terrific space. In addition, follow me, Chris. I'm walking fast, bud. You do have this massive pass-through storage up here at the front. So as if you couldn't bring enough things with you in the back, look at all this you can keep up here. A couple other things we'll talk about out at the front. Chris, you can just show them. We have a fantastically large awning with LEDs that's gonna make the nighttime day if you need them to. Solid state steps or solid steps. I've talked about these a lot in videos. These are great if you have pets, makes it easier for them to get in out. If you're older and have trouble, or maybe you had a little too much to drink, these are fantastic to get in and out of the camper. You got a nice little grab bag. Grab bag, grab handle, or whatever. All right, come on, Chris. We're gonna start at the back of the unit. So directly below me is that massive pass-through storage that I was showing you earlier with the drawer that comes out, but we're standing in the main living area. So as you see, we have a massive TV with a lot of storage on both sides. Your CD, DVD player, Blu-ray player, all thing player is right back behind here. Does have a nice size fireplace. Fireplaces are great. They run off electricity. They're gonna give you nice little heat in here. You're not gonna have to use your propane. On both sides, you have what I call love seats. I guess they're couches. Those do fold out into beds. So you can sleep a lot of people up here. You also have a set of theater seating here, reclining theater seating, which is great. And Chris, you might not be able to see it, but right here is actually your quiet, cool ducts. So on those hot days, you could be running the air, air conditioning, stay nice and cool in here, but still be able to hear the TV, which is great. And Chris, you can stay up here. I'll show them the kitchen. I do want to talk about the colors in this. This is an updated color scheme from Montana this year, and I think they absolutely killed it. One of the top things we're hearing from people is how beautiful these units are. If we look over here to the left, we have tons and tons of countertop space. They actually cover the sink with these little, whatever you want to call them, to give you uh, extra space on here for prep. But plenty of countertop space, a lot of cabinets below the, below the sink and above. Massive microwave, three burner stove, which is great. One of my favorite things, which is the freestanding booth dinette. I just love that. It's great for playing board games, sitting around eating, and you've got these awesome windows to sit here and people watch while you're having your breakfast, lunch, dinner, whatever you're doing. Residential sized refrigerator. So you can literally take all the groceries you need for a whole week of camping in this bad boy. And as you saw from the outside storage, you can literally bring half the house with you as well. You do have this awesome pantry. So if it's not cold and you need to store it, you got a place right here. More storage over here with this little nook. I don't know what you put there. Maybe it's a Keurig, maybe it's a margarita maker, I don't know. So let's go check out the front. So I'm gonna step inside the bathroom now. Big bathroom, beautiful bathroom actually. You have a large sit down shower here. You have all this cabinetry here for uh, your toiletries, your linens. You have the his and hers um, sinks, which is great. Your own medicine cabinets on each side. So you can keep your stuff separate from him. He can keep his stuff separate from you. More storage below, which is great. Toilet, of course, you kind of got to have one of those in the bathroom, but it's great to have a toilet in here. And again, I want to talk about the color scheme. I think this bathroom feels even bigger than it is because of this light color scheme they have in here. Let's go check out the bedroom. So in the bedroom, you're gonna notice we have a king size bed. There is storage below the bed. We have this beautiful shiplap. I actually said that right for the first time ever. This beautiful shiplap behind the bed, which really accents it. The bed is on a small slide, which makes it feel like you have more room in here. 
directly next to the bed, you have a massive closet, which is gonna keep all your clothes for, again, a week or two. Additionally, you have a closet over here that is washer dryer prepped. So if you don't wanna use this as storage and you wanna use it for washer and dryer, this, again, um, I think is a perfect unit for like those week or even two weeks in golf shores or wherever you're going to go because not only can you bring all your toys with you, you have plenty of room for the family, you have tons of room for storage, and you can do all your own laundry. One last thing to mention directly across from the bed, you have your TV backer and you have these drawers here where you can keep even more clothes. So this is the Montana 373RD. This was another episode of Walkthrough Wednesday. Thanks for watching.